there needs to be a challenge provided. I think that there has to be some sense of accomplishment that makes playing it worthwhile. Games are a neat way to play with a model of the world and see how the world works. Of course, they do have to be fun and, that's, and they have to be playful. But I just also love the fact that the whole point of game is that it's a challenge. I'm a visual person, so I really like strong visuals. I think it was the artwork in the games and the characters. Somehow you could relate to them, even though there's just a few pixels on a screen. But yeah, it was always very exciting for me. I think there definitely has to be some experience that's different than what you'd get from a different sort of activity. I feel like you have to feel immersed. Imagination and exploration and a whole world opens up that was so not the real world for me. A good game should be very easy to pick up on and to work out and how to play. Now it might be that there's quite complex play patterns, but a good game will sort of bring you into those gradually. I like the added stimulation of the uh, content that you're interacting with changing as the activity progresses. It's not just a, a static um, set level of content. All games are educational. You're always learning. If a game is fun, it's fun because you're learning. If you've got a game that isn't um, about the interactions between the people, um, that's a lot of single player games are like this, you probably want to provide something that says why what you're doing is interesting or important. There have to be lots of different ways to play it so that you can keep coming back to it.